Right now, polish ten toes down. Hey beautiful people and welcome or welcome back to my channel Nikki Styles Her Curves. I am Nikki and today we are starting a brand new vlog. We have been consistent over here. I love that for us. If this is your first time watching my channel, I focus mainly on fashion, beauty, lifestyle, travel. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. So if that is your thing, you definitely want to click the subscribe button. So we're starting a new vlog and we're going somewhere. So I have a bit of a story time. So um, if you watch the channel or if you don't, um, about about two weeks ago, I went to the Kylie X Crumble event in New York City. So it was like a pop up. It was open to the public. But although it was open to the public, I went there. I created a real TikTok, tagged the brands, all of that good stuff. So shoot to right now, about two or three days ago, the PR team at Crumble reached out to me personally and invited me to their grand opening of a new store in the city. And um, the PR manager said that he would introduce me to the founder of Crumble. And so we're going to the city to go to the grand opening. Also, while we're out there, my best friend's birthday was this week. If you saw the last vlog, we missed each other. We were supposed to meet up and due to transportation issues, we could not link up, but this time we're going to make it up. And so I'm going to bring my son. She's going to bring her daughter and we're going to make a day of it. So we're going to go to Crumble. And then after that, we um, are going to go to the Museum of Illusions, which is also in the city. It's my first time going there. I was invited some time back, but this is the first time that I'm available. And since we're going with the kids, I thought that it would be a nice treat for them. But yeah, so we are dressed and ready. I just finished filming a Get Ready With Me, me video. It should already be edited, so I'll go ahead and insert the outfit. I recently went to a Crumble Cookies pop-up event that was open to the public. I created some content recapping and highlighting the event. I made sure to tag the brand, of course. And a week later, I was invited to meet the founder and the entire PR so team. So let's head to New York for some Crumble Cookies. So that is the look for today. And it's kind of rainy and nasty outside, so I'm hoping that it stops raining because when it rains, I honestly don't even want to go outside. But I already committed to this and like we're going to push through. We're going to make it through. I'm going to bring some makeup for touch-ups because I just did a little tutorial on this look using Primark products. I um, mean, that was at the end of my last vlog. But let's go ahead and head to the city to go to the Crumble um, grand opening. The larger version. Okay. So right now we have a mini version for you, and you get to choose one flavor. So which flavor would you like? What are the options? We have lemon blackberry cake or banana pudding. Okay, guys. So we made it to the crumble pop up. Unfortunately, there are protesters here, and so I can't really talk because the audio is going to be non-existent, but everyone has been so nice, so amazing. I was able to meet the founder as well as the director of PR. The staff has been amazing. We took pictures together and videos, and we're going to stay here for a little while, eat our snacks, and then we're heading to the Museum of Illusions. Yeah, come on, family. Um, yeah. Fourteen is right here, so like we'd be 
it down, we'd be bound to find Dollar Pizza. Oh, I thought it was in this flower place. I'm like, that's definitely not a dollar. Hey, beautiful people. So it is a few days later and probably like two or three days. And so we went to the Crumble event. I met the founder of Crumble as well as their PR manager. It was definitely a vibe. Everyone on their staff was so, so nice. We had an amazing time with my bestie and her daughter and my son. And then we went to the Museum of Illusions, which was actually not that far away. It was probably about 10 minutes in the Uber. So we went there, we went through all of the exhibits and it was really, really cool. The kids had a great day. We kind of just wish we had a little bit more time together, but you know, that's life. So I'm sure that me and my bestie will be back together again soon. And hopefully we can have another little cute thing to do with the kids. So today is going to be um, a beach day, but only for a little bit. So I think we're gonna be here at the beach for about an hour. Um, just lay out, let the kids go in the water. Um, and then we have some sandwiches that we made. So we'll come back up and eat. And then after that, like the rest of the day, I have quite a few things to do. So I'm going on a trip next week and I need to prepare. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to probably do my feet. I'm gonna do my hair. I'm gonna try to pack. So it's a lot of things that needs to get done. I also need to film a little bit of content before I leave because I filmed a Shein haul, but I didn't do the try on portion. So I just need to do that. Time will bring the red on and the watch for a day. There'll be no remnants, no trace, no residual. You feel that within you, then you will remember me. Your face will be the reason I smile, but I will not see what I cannot have forever. I'll always be you. We are actually heading to tea around town. So I have my tea party outfit on. Of course, I'm going to take you guys with me. And if you're not familiar, tea around town is basically like a New York City tour bus that has like a tea party theme and they have treats and teas and all that good stuff. So Okay guys, so we just got back from Tea Around Town. It was so nice. 
It was so, so pretty. Um, I did walk there and it was about a 15 minute walk. Uh, and then my friend Amanda came to meet up with me and um, it was my first time getting to like really chill with her. Like I've met her in person before and we follow each other on Instagram, but it was my first time getting to really chill with her. She is so cool. I will put her Instagram handle on the screen. So if you don't follow her, please be sure to check her out. But the bus was about 90 minutes. Um, and I would say that the time went by pretty quickly. We took a lot of pictures, a lot of videos. We went by the Rockefeller Center. We went by Radio City Music Hall, Fifth Avenue. Lots of different amazing tourist spots. And if you would like to, you know, check out the bus for yourself, I will have a discount code also below in the description box so that you can check it out. I think it's like 5% off, but something is better than nothing. So I will definitely put that below for you guys. But my husband just came to meet me and we are at the hotel. So I'm going to go ahead and change into something else. And then we're probably going to get something to eat. Um, there's a few things going on in the city. So maybe we'll be able to check something out. And then later on, we have a little event planned out. So of course, I will take you guys with me. My camera is acting funny right now so I'm just recording from my phone but hopefully I can figure out what's going on with my camera because it's just filming kind of light like the white balance is off and I haven't figured out how to correct it but hopefully I figure it out so that the quality gets better but let's go ahead change our clothes and get ready for the next thing Cosmetics was having something, so we stopped there and I recorded some footage so you guys could see what they had going on. They were um, like giving out some makeup and they had some games, they were also um, color matching, and so I did the color matching so they could let me know what color I would be in their CC cream and i had like gotten my they were giving out makeup brushes and the guy said that i had gotten like the last one of the brushes and they were engraving them so i got my brush engraved so that was really cool i also got some stuff from it cosmetics and pr so once i get back from what, where we're going I will share that with you guys. But right now, we are heading to, I think it's called Sculpting in the Dark. I think it's called Sculpting in the Dark, but I'm not 100% sure, but I think either you're blindfolded or they turn the lights off and you make sculptures. So I figured that that would be something cool to try and it's kind of like a more casual vibe so 
I don't really have to do too much, but we don't have that much time. Clearly we have packed a lot into today, but I just want to kind of soften up my makeup. I changed my clothes. Um, so we're taking a little breather and then we are going to head out to this sculpting in the dark. I don't know if I'm going to be able to record because if it's dark, then there's going to be nothing for you guys to see. But I will record, you know, as much as I can. And hopefully it's enough for you guys to get an idea of what we're doing. Okay, guys, so we had a very limited amount of time to change, but this is the outfit. So I'm wearing this top, which is from Express. These jeans, which are from The Gap, and they have like a little split there. And these shoes are from ASOS, and then this is my TJ Maxx bag. So uh, let's head out. Thank you. 